wine weirdos. Christopher. Let's check out the 2013 Fox and Biennecito Vineyard Chardonnay Block W. That's U U. Ah, Biennecito liking that. Yes. $32 wine coming at around 14.3 alcohol by volume. 1,450 cases of this are made. Nice. And we've got a pretty uh, light and young gold yellow in the glass. It's pretty yellow to me. Mm -hmm. What's it doing on the nose, Christopher? Well, I can tell this is a drought year on the aromatics. I can tell there's going to be some concentration on mm -hmm. in the palate mm -hmm. from the aromatics. Loads of citrus, pineapple, kind of an interesting muted mineral play, like a chalk play on the aromatics, and tons of citrus blossom. Yep, and there's mainly a mineral-based butter, oil, hazelnut, roasted almond, um, maybe a little bit of citrus hiding there, like some tangelo hiding mm -hmm. underneath it, but boy, this is not fruit forward. This is more of a dry, mm -hmm. uh, buttery style, maybe hinting at like a Chablis type style. Yeah, I agree. Really this, interesting. You can tell this is concentrated fruit. Maybe they were wrestling with the alcohol number, getting it down, mm -hmm. and they toned it down, which is giving it a really nice roundness. The citrus play is quite exquisite yep. and food friendly. Yep. But uh, the acidity is just, I'm not, it's, there's not the acidic cut that I'm used to True. from Foxen. Yep. But it's a unique play, and I think it's so, it's so fruit friendly for my palate that I could see Psalm serving this. Yeah, I think with food, this is going to go really well. Even mm -hmm. on its own, though, for wine nerds, I think this is one to look out for. Yeah, especially since it's a drought vintage. It's bringing a lot of complexity, mm -hmm. and I think it's a different look at Chardonnay done in California. Absolutely. Cool stuff from Foxen. We'll be back with more on Wine Weirdos. Cheers. Cheers.